What? What? You're just gonna stand there and look at me? I mean... Woof. 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 <sighs> Blew my cover, didn't I? I'm a dog, and I gotta talk. Hey, what's up, guys? JRE Show here. And today we got some awesome software to look look at. It is called Crazy Talk 7 Pro, and that's basically what I just got done using there to animate uh, my mom's dog, Winston. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and show you how easy it is to uh, use first. I'm using the Mac version. They also have a Windows version. I'm just gonna drag a picture of my friend Rick into Crazy Talk 7. Pro and I'll just start by cropping his head like that. Oh, that's Winston barking right there. And it will give you these numbers to align the eyes. You can see up here where to put those numbers at. It's just like at the end, ends of their lips. Um, and that's good there. And it will give me uh, something, some more lines to line up his eyebrows and such. Let's go ahead and line all these up the best I can. Wanna put these around the outside of their face. So what we're kind of doing is defining the area we want to animate. So that looks pretty good. Now they have these tools. Um, you can see how the person is going to look. We'll click on eyes, eyes here. Eyes closing and blinking. So if you didn't like them uh, right away, there's also this, this other one that will add more lines. And that's really good because you can zoom in or zoom out. And we can line these up better to make it even more realistic. like that it's okay if it's not perfect because I'm going to show you how to add eyeballs that looks pretty good now you'll see these outside lines right here <clears throat> these are for where you want to put like the ears if you had a dog you want to include uh, the ears into that or maybe a hat so that's what I'm doing here And they'll let you preview so you can make changes as you need to. Up, down, left, right, tilt left. Let's see, we want to bring maybe his head up just a little bit here. And we can preview it again. Up, down, left, right. And his ch uh, chin looked a little square, so we can. Oops move all that there and that should be good that should be good for now go ahead and hit next and it will bring you to the uh, face orientation this is basically you look up here at the right corner uh, what what type of head is it do they have a big nose is it a flat nose is it a robot is it a pug is it an animated ball um, but that's what you're going to want to do and kind of line that up and I'll let you preview it. <clears throat> and his head looks a little square, but that's okay. We can fix that up later. And we'll just go ahead and hit OK. And now that we have him here, you can see he's got this green background. Well, what if we want to make him with just a white background or maybe um, a different background? Well, that's easy enough. You just go ahead and click on this. Uh, icon right here and you can see it already does it a lot of it for you um, and it does that basically by how you edit it uh, the before and but we can go ahead and clear some of this out 
clear this blue out of here real quick. There's an edge blur down here, so if you wanted it to be a little more edgy, it's going to be a little bit green around the outsides just because he has a green background. But if you were to use maybe a white background or even a background that matches the tone of their skin. Go ahead and just speed this up, but you see how simple it is, and I can make the brush size smaller. And say if I went into the green a little bit, I can switch over here, and that will cancel out the blue. So it, it works both ways. I'm just gonna go ahead and finish this up, and speed this up a little bit. Okay, now that we have our character cropped, we can go ahead um, and add maybe some eyes, because the eyes you want to make them more anime looking. I have those two. We can switch through these. And we can also have human eyes. We'll give them some human eyes. And if they don't look right, right off the bat, let's see what it looks like here in a second. Which they don't look bad. He's kind of looking up, but that's okay. But we can actually go back in and adjust the way those eyes look, starting with the eyeball irises irises iris so we can make those darker or maybe more blue just the brightness and also with the eye whiteness we can make them brighter to darker and also if the eyeballs aren't in the right position you feel you can also adjust those two and even make them bigger and we can roll those around just like that but that looks pretty good and now we got his eyeballs let's add some teeth we just click on this teeth icon right here and you can see if you don't have the best teeth you can fix them we'll go ahead and give them some braces here and same thing with the teeth you can also adjust the brightness um, you can actually move them left to right up and down make them bigger and spin them but they look good right about there. And the throat, kind of match it to see what you think the throat, if you think it'd be a little bit darker. And that looks good right there. Um, enough with that, I wanna get right into, you can see, let's add, a, let's add a background real quick. I'm not gonna use that background. I'm gonna use, let's see here. Let's use this background right here. there we go now that we have him animated for the most part we can go and check out their voice scripts you can also record say if you want to record your own you just record right there that's what I did for Winston or say if you wanted them to sing you could import an audio track but for right now I'm just gonna have him uh, let's make him rap and when you click on these, you can put them in talk mode, listen mode. Say you wanted them to just listen. That's what you use listen mode for. And they have lip sync only. I'm going to put them in talk mode, though. Yo, 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 turn my mic up. Oh, yeah, just like that. Hey, yo, check it. Yo, I'm rhyming off the top of the head. So I got to get these words right or I won't get fed. You see, my voice is golden, something like a spokesperson. You want to see me? I'm about to be GQ's moon man of the moment, and <laughs> I don't mess up. So that's that was pretty cool there. Uh, but let's say he doesn't quite match the facial expression of how he's talking. Well, that's easy enough, too. We can go here and record their actions. Uh, this is the face animation profile. They have a guy, a girl, a child, another child. Um, and let's say we wanted to make him... Uh, we'll go here. No, let's actually go... Let's go here. And you can preview them. You know, look at all these you can click on here. Let's preview one. Let's see. Click. And I'm just dragging my mouse around this little thing right here. So if I wanted to record, I'd go to the place I wanted to record, and it would record right off, right over the default uh, talk motion. So I'm gonna hit record now. And spacebar. Yeah, yeah, 
Yo, turn my mic up. Oh, yeah, just like that. And yo, check it. Yo, I'm rhyming off the top of the head. So I got to get these words right or I won't get fed. You see, my voice is... <laughs> so that's, that's one, but I could go through here and match him up maybe just perfectly to... And if you look here, they have the head moment. So you can move the head around. Woo, woo, just like that, which is pretty cool. And I can go back here and do another record. I gotta get these words right or I won't get fed. You see, my voice is golden, something like a spokesperson. You want to see me? I'm about to be GQ's moment man of the moment, and I don't mess up, so I fix it up. You come get me, you might get fixed up, because I wash you out. <laughs> and you can experiment with these to get it just how you want it. I mean, there's there's one there for everything. Um, and I can just do a couple more. There's a lot. There's a lot to do. But you can see what I've done here in just the last, what, 10, 12 minutes. I've created this already. Um, but we could put them in, uh, let's, let's, let's give an example of listen mode real quick. And this is going to be an evil laugh. <laughs> or we could do shouting. Let's give it uh, a lip sync of that. And this would be a good example. I looked at. I want to go back here, and this would be a good example. This kind of this guy kind of looked like he had some whiny faces. So let's. Uh, and you can animate all these. You can go to in the advanced settings, and actually head tilting. You can change these values and things. But I'm going to show you this just real quick. Okay. Wait a minute. That's the wrong way. We need to go through this tunnel. Follow me, quick. And there I was moving my mouse up and down so you can uh, simulate more talking, more mouth action. But that is Crazy Talk 7 Pro. It's some great software, very user friendly. Uh, it just allows you to open up your creativity and to do just about anything. I'll put a link in the description area of where you can get this software. Uh, so check it out. Jerry Show here. Thanks for watching.